Hey, Raga, right, I gotta dancing. say it. This party is lit. <laughs> Wait, no, no. Rock guy's supposed to. Hello, good morning, everyone. They treat it like Christmas morning. It is the last birthday of summer. It is Rock guy's birthday. They have gathered at the top of the stairs. <laughs> Literally like Christmas morning, you guys. And I keep telling him. I don't know why everyone's so excited for this random Saturday. It's like, it's Saturday. All right, whatever. guys, let's get to the chores. <laughs> chores first, so let's go ahead and come on down. Let's get our chore list going. I know, first up, we're going to have to clean this kitchen out. It is it's a disaster. Saturday. I mean, this is... You gotta clean this up, Ryler. Get to the kitchen and clean it. Clean that mess up. Oh my god. <laughs> Happy birthday! This kid is 12 today, you guys. I'm 12. Old. Look at those numbers. That just looks old, Wait, man. About this time, 12 years ago, we were just walking in the hospital. Walking in as a newly married couple. We've been married for what? Three years? A year? A yeah. day? A Two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> we walk into the hospital having no clue. First thing out of the gates, throwing on the birthday button. Love it. That way we know, just in case we forget, it's you're the one having the birthday today, right? Not me. Let's get started with breakfast. You get to choose what we do today the entire day. As you know, we do have your friend party tonight, which is going to be off the hook. Make sure you guys stick around and check that out. It's going to be so epic. But as far as the day goes, we get to choose what we do and the order we do that in. So, we could have breakfast right now. Nope. We could go downstairs and just check out the new kitchenette in the basement. No. We could go fix the sprinkler that's kind of like bubbling over right now. Maybe later. Open presents right now? We could open presents right now. Yes. Okay, let's open presents right now. Okay, now mom. It's not like we have to, but we may want to guide you towards a Which certain one do you order. Want to open first? If you are looking at and be Rye Guy, you want to go big first. It's your birthday. Go big first. None of this saving. That's cruise thing. I'll go medium. This one. Okay, fine. Medium. Medium's good. Medium's good. We can do medium. Rye Guy, not going for the biggest box in the bunch, but going medium size. Start with this one. It's so good. So present number one. What do you see on the box, Rye Guy? What is it? Lulu. And what kind of a hat are you wearing right now? Lulu. Perhaps a replacement hat for the been Lulu. For one. Been asking for it for a while now. You know how much you love hats. Oh Mom tapes things way too much. Yeah, I got a towel. Oh, <laughs> a towel. I actually been looking for this. Well, no way. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Happy birthday what? to you. Happy birthday. You got your first phone. No way. <laughs> Well, buddy. Hey, what do you think? Oh my gosh. Time for I multiple contacts, some regular text messaging, private phone calls. Well, we don't need this thing anymore. I'll take that. <laughs> hey, you need that because then we can get a hold of you. All right, guys, there you go, buddy. What do you think? Let me take a look I at it. I love it. Dang it, you didn't get a hat. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about the no hat. Okay. That was a good trigger. Oh this is a pretty big deal. Now, we have to explain to Rye Guy because this group here, this Gab Wireless, they just came out with a brand new phone with a few cool new features That's that Ryler was dying to get. <laughs> However, it doesn't come out until next month, so Mom looked pretty heavily into it how we could get him the new phone, and the really the only way to do that is either to return this one so he has no phone on his birthday, which would have been such a bummer because he's been so hyped for yeah. this, yeah. or when it comes out next month, you can actually they have a program where you can turn in your old one and exchange it for the new yeah. one. He's just gonna get this, oh my gosh, there it is right there. There it is right there. He's gonna play with this, get his contacts in it, his friends, start using it, get the line set up, and then when the new one comes out next month, we'll do an exchange we'll on, and get the new one. I don't remember your phone number. Right guy, but you right have guy. more than 10 contacts. You can now have more than three friends. Yes! Bro, there's your phone, champ. Yes! <laughs> kind of a big one to start with. You went for the first box with the phone. We're like, well, okay, yeah, let's okay. start big. Here we go. Fry guy, you've opened the phone. That's the main reason you couldn't sleep last night. Oh my gosh. Do I you know. want to be done opening or you want to keep going? Keep on going. Uh, keep going, keep going, okay. I forgot about this, you guys. Do you know what this, this is? is? It's a kid debit card. It's a debit card, bro. Ski. Ball. So it has $5 on it. <laughs> Just kidding, it has 50. <laughs> That's like five dollars. That sucks. I love that it has my picture. So, so Raga has your picture. It's a yeah. real debit card. You take that into like Walmart and you're scanning it but and making this purchases. Has real money on it, so you yeah. cannot lose it. Yeah, if someone it steals it or finds it, don't waste it too. You have to be responsible. It's an actual card like we carry around. But here's what's cool, dude. If you do like you know babysitting, some extra chores, something that you've oh, done you to earn money, to mom this. can just load money onto that from her phone in an app, and then boom, you've got money on there. So all those now times. I don't have all that imaginary money. <laughs> Thank you. That's exactly what I was gonna say. Ryler does a very good job of keeping track of every time I say I'll give you five bucks if you do this. Adds up every dollar and then he gets to this huge number and I'm like, where did that number come from? But now, hold us to it. We can get the actual number on that card. 
Kind of got the two biggest ones out of the gates. You're literally 12 for about five minutes and you've got a phone and a debit card. Life is moving fast. What's gonna be next, dude? I think I actually picked this out. <gasps> no way! What? I wanted this! Bro. Debit card and cologne. This guy is this growing is up. Fast. This is the 12 year old birthday, man. Oh We've got gosh. cologne I now. I bought this that day. I just hit it from you. you. <laughs> Moms are good at this stuff, dude. Moms are good at this oh stuff. Oh my gosh. So this is the original, original one that everybody loves. Broski, that one's the called guy Fierce. That help was helping us that day. He helped let me pick it up. No way. Next up, next up. Hi guys, moving through these gifts pretty quickly. So far, it's been a pretty good birthday. No way. <laughs> what? What's this one? I was hoping I would get this. Well, How about a... You need to protect it and keep it safe. How about oh, a and case actually, and yeah. a screen projector yeah, for the new phone? It it tight, I'm gonna have like you put that on. I'll put this one. Bro, you're gonna be loaded up with your phone. <laughs> you're gonna match me because I have a spring, a screen protector. You do too? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, there is the Lulu hat. <laughs> That's the box that it came in, but mom was trying to confuse you for putting it in a different box. That one is literally worn every day. You probably wear it to bed. Oh, oh my gosh, are you the model on the website? You look insane, bro. I do love that hat on you. This is actually a surprising turn of events. They're doing the big birthday boy box last. I wouldn't have expected that. However, little did he know, he did go biggest first. It just wasn't in the biggest box. So this one, right, guy, what could that be? Soup cans, composition notebook. Still haven't got that composition notebook. <laughs> so stop riding your brother's scooters. <laughs> what? Your very own scooter. <laughs> Those colors are insane. Do you like? Let's Let's check it out, bad boy. I'm gonna go build this thing right now. <laughs> <laughs> You guys know how I do this while I start breakfast. What does the birthday boy want? Breakfast burritos. Breakfast burritos. Breakfast burritos on the menu. Okay, let's do it. Scooters all put together, dialed in, looking good, and Ryan guys moving on to the phone now. Let's see what's inside this bag. Oh, I can't believe it's actually a phone. You have a phone, dude. Phone calls, text. Now, guys, this phone is a little bit different. You've heard us talk about it in the past, but this phone actually just makes phone calls, texts, and has a camera on it, but it does not allow any apps, any internet, so he's able to have a phone and have the fun and flexibility of communicating with friends without all of those dangers of a normal phone in the hands of a very responsible but still yet 12-year-old. We are very, very pumped about this being your first phone, dude. Yes, I love it. I have a freaking phone. Oh, sweet. <laughs> right, guys, you got a phone, bro. Guys, not only is it activating, but it's got his birthday right oh, there. First day of use. This is a big deal, dude. Can I get your number, bro? Can I get your number? <laughs> <laughs> Green junkie, get off that phone and let's eat. Just kidding, he hasn't been on it at all. But breakfast Fritos going down hot, fresh, warm tortillas. Birthday boy, you're up first, bro. Unless you got some important Actually, business mom, to handle here. You can go first, no, it's your birthday. Doing the thing My where he's birthday, choosing you over me again. Oh, I don't know what happened when you turned 12, but you turned on me. You turned a traitor at 12. You know Rag Eye in true Rag Eye form, first thing he does is go into the settings, tweak, customize. He's put in contacts with profile pictures, set up his wallpaper and lock screen, home code. It's been about three minutes. I think he's gonna get a lot of good use out of this thing. Uh, not that we know. Adding in some contacts into his phone. He's got his mom and dad. He's putting in Mana and Papa. He's got both of his grandparents in there. Throwing in some contacts into his new phone. Okay, this guy Mana's number again here, buddy. So we told Rye Guy today is his birthday. It can be anything and everything he wants it to be. Where are you, Rye Guy? So we have the opportunity to go grab some lunch right now. Rye Guy's wanting kind of a chill day. He's actually requested a not so epic, not so crazy day. He's got a friend party tonight that's gonna go kind of late. Wants to save some energy for that. He's enjoying texting and calling all of his friends and family. Yep. So he wants to go to lunch to a place nearby here we can actually ride scooters to get to. So we can break out his new scooter. Kids can go on a scooter ride. Mom and I will walk. We'll go grab a bite to eat. We come back, chill, rest before the big epic movie party tonight. Have we even said that it's a movie party yet? We're doing an outdoor cinema, full blown. Like you know, we did this a couple years ago or last year. The inflatable theater in the backyard. This time we are getting a full blown movie theater, full sound system, everything set up at a park nearby. It'd be insane. He's inviting like every friend he's ever met. There's yeah. gonna be so many kids there. Thirteen friends coming over to this thing, so it's going to be a ton of fun. First, we're just gonna take a nice stroll as a family. Go grab a bite to eat on this guy's birthday. Oh yeah.
Drew got the fall off the bone chicken fingers. <laughs> he just picked up, he's like, Dad, this is fall off the bone. It's so good. <laughs> yeah. We are back from our lunch. It is hot. Can you see the glisten on my face? All we did is walk. It's hot. Like a few blocks. We are soaking sweat. There's a heat advisory in the area. Lunch. We need a shower. But we are going to do exactly what Ragai wants. He just wants to chill, relax, and gear up for an epic party tonight oh, yeah. with 13 of his closest friends. Doing an outdoor cinema movie. We got some stuff to do to prepare for that, to get ready to set up. And then it's party time tonight. So, guys, let's chill. Let's get our party on later. It's going to be awesome. Later. We have arrived on location here where the movie is going to be going down tonight. But we have a small change of plans. We've got a new way, a new format in which we were going to be showcasing this movie because as you know, here in this neighborhood, near the mouth of the canyon, the winds pick up. It gets pretty gnarly up here. I have a plan B in place because the winds are starting to whip, but this one is windproof, foolproof, and fun-filled. Check it out. Check it out, this is going to be our setup for the night. It's a brilliant solution. Last time he was in this area, by the way, you guys, this is our friend Marcus Wing with 4FX Productions. They actually ride motocross, all of his kids ride motocross with crew, and that's where we met. Ironically, the night we got our silver play button in the mail from YouTube was our first time on their backyard track. So history runs deep here with these guys, but he does this kind of stuff on the regular. He was in our area a couple weeks ago, almost lost the screen to the wind, and so this is the fail-safe backup solution. It's a white truck, perfect size, just the same size as the screen we would have been using, but it's not going anywhere. The wind's not gonna do anything to it. We set up the projector on it. Speakers are loud. It's bright, it's beautiful. We've got this entire field to put the kids in on blankets, pillows. We got a popcorn machine. It's going down right here in this field tonight. Right guy's birthday party. I think it's gonna be epic. Back home now, getting prepped for all of the fun goodies that will be involved in the party. Uh, you know there's goodies. You can't go to a movie without some movie goodies. So mom, what do we got? I went ahead oh and bought all oh of boy. these that were a dollar. Movie theater size candy for everyone. And then I bought Nerd Ropes, Twizzlers. Twizz these, love it. The little cans of Sprite, oh, Fanta, Gatorade. Gatorade. Then we rent a popcorn <laughs> machine. Tons of popcorn. This is a movie theater style popcorn where you put it in the popcorn maker, it just kind of mixes and blends the butter and the kernels, spits out that delicious popcorn. Probably should get a garbage bag. Gotta get some blankets, gotta get some fun stuff. We gotta get buckets of ice and all the things. We got things mostly set up now. We're battling a little bit of a sprinkler issue. Turns out the sprinklers are turning on right now as we're getting things set up. So we're trying to figure out where we can position things so we're not going to be soaked by the sprinklers. Party's going down. I don't even have a watch on. What time is it, sweetie? Any idea? Party's going down in about three minutes. So people should be arriving any minute now. We've got everything set up. We got the candy out. Popcorn's Here's what I popping. Know. Out of 24 hours in an entire day, how is it that the sprinklers would come on right now? That's how it works. We'll find a way. It's just going to be nothing but fun tonight. We've got the popcorn popping. You can smell it in the air. We've got candy out on the table. Tastes good too. We've got blankets, chairs. We just need the sun to set a little bit more so we can see the movie, but for right now, just enjoying this incredible sunset. Sun has set. We're calling an audible here though because these sprinklers just came on and even if we figure out how to get them turned off, they've soaked the area we're gonna sit in. So we're gonna flip this thing around, try and watch it on the other side in the parking lot. Not necessarily as comfortable as a vibe, but we could do like a drive-in movie type, load kids in the back of the van, back of the truck. We've got some chairs. I think it's still gonna work. Now we have upper deck seating in the back of the truck. We've got lower deck here. Then we'll have floor seating here. All coming together. We're getting the thing set up on the side of the truck. Both sides work. That's the beauty of having this truck as the screen, as the main setup, because the movie screen would have had to reverse the entire thing. This way we just had to pull the table around into the parking lot. I think we're pulling this thing off. Got to move the popcorn machine down. Candy station. Just kind of flipping everything right now, but coming together perfectly just as the sun dips, just as we're about to watch the movie. Couldn't be going better. Coming together, we've got the back seat of the van, back seat of the truck, chairs. We're just about ready for our feature film tonight. The sun has set. We've gathered Riley's friends here behind us. They're ready to take in this movie. It's the perfect finish to the perfect birthday today, you guys. We've got all of his friends here. We've got popcorn, candies being handed out. It's just dark enough that we can start the movie. We've been watching some coming attractions, some GoPro videos right now, but the movie is ready to rock right here on the side of this truck. Go time, movie style, right guy. Hey, birthday boy. Yeah. Should we get this party started? Yeah. Right guy, are we ready to start this movie? Yeah. Woo! Let's go.
party could not be going better. I'm so excited for Rye Guy. He had such a turnout, so many friends. The movie's playing perfectly. We avoided the whole sprinkler issue. It's working with the chairs and truck and van setup that we have. I think it's kind of funny, almost ironic, that he had chosen Emoji Movie, not knowing for sure that he was getting a phone, but so excited today to be able to text people and actually send them emojis. This is all new to him. Very appropriate and applicable movie to be watching with his friends here tonight. Happy birthday, dear Ryler. Happy birthday to you. The night is winding down. Rye Guy has just finished opening up his presents and we're going for an epic group picture with everybody, pyramid style, in the back of the truck. I don't know if we're gonna be able to pull this off. A lot of kids in the back of my truck right now. Hey Rye Guy, I gotta say it, this party is lit. <laughs> I've returned home with the birthday boy. How was the party, dude? It was awesome. I think everybody's <laughs> We're so pretty tired. Because I think it's like the it's gauntlet 11 though. of birthdays though. We are now done for a while, a little yes. bit of a breather. We are going back to school on Monday. By the time this vlog it. uploads, these kids will have experienced their very first day of school, Aww, which is a big deal. That's I'm kind of sad, Rye Guy, I'm gonna miss you. Perfect summer send off though. Rather, I will tell you, you have some great friends. Very thoughtful, fun, supportive. I cried to two of the moms tonight, just telling her that it is an answer to prayers that Ryler has as good of friends as he has, because it is something I honestly prayed for. He would have good friends to surround him, and I know that he is just as good of a friend to those kids too, so it's an awesome night. So you guys, make sure you come back. Thanks for hanging with us. Good night, everybody. Happy birthday, Rye Guy! I have a freaking phone.